Yurts. That's where the yurts are. Okay, so now that my bike's making noise, uh, I'm going to start going up toward the bobsled, but I'm not going to do bobsled. I'm going to do that new trail. So what I got to do is... <clears throat> okay, here's the trout. So this is the trailhead return trout. So this is the trail that goes. It's a little bit loose right here. Oh my gosh, it's rugged. I have not done this trail in a life age. So this is almost new to me. I did this uh, at least once last year. Uh, there's supposed to be a new connector up here. Okay, here we go. There is the new connector. To the left, he says. A unit connector. So now we're getting off of tiny range recreation. Oh, it's like a night and day difference with the dirt. Probably gonna be an ultimate easy trail. In truth, this was a very easy, fun trail, but little did I know, I was slowly going uphill. And the best part of the trail was, of course, yet to come. All right, so now we're going to the State Forest Land and Leaving Cayenne. This is official. This is one of those idealistic weather temperature and there's like no sun, overcast, and cool. It's nice. I don't think I need my knee pads for this trail. Now that's the first... I keep saying that's the first jump, but no, that's not really a jump. I mean, you could crank into it, fly off of it, but... I have a feeling that there's going to be some downhill. Either still ahead of me here, or when I return. So you have to endure some chatter, loose rock and stuff to get back here. From the Yonke unit. But you could probably, yeah, see this is what I was expecting. Um, a little bit of, a little bit of, woo! Oh yeah, that's what I was hoping for, was a little bit of something. Yeah. No brakes. I tried to jump stuff. Wow. Nice trail from one from really easy and boring to lots of fun. Keep pedaling. We don't know what's ahead of us. Wow, I broke from the woods. Oh, I was not expecting that. I'm seeing more tire tracks here too because I think this is more of a sandy. Wow, this is crazy. I'm glad I started the camera again. I was thinking it's gonna get pretty awesome, and yeah, it's getting pretty awesome. Although I am feeling the looseness here more than anything else. There's a rock launch. So they got some stuff on this. Wow. I'm gonna be going back uphill again. Okay, so there's a road. I think that's the private road go sit here wow this is this is rocking this reminds me of welch village it takes a while to go in but whoa tires how many last are fat tires <laughs> they're actually car tires on the way well if nothing else, that was a pretty fun section. That was worth coming back here for. I think it continues. Mm. Ah, a little bit of washout right there. I have a feeling I'm going to go uphill again. Probably. So this next clip, my GoPro decided to film upside down. Don't know why. But this is me exiting the other side. 
and my next trip was down the road to the pump track. When I came over here last time, there was nobody over here. Now there is 20,000 people here. Yeah, all bikers. This is destination bike land. Look at it. That's awesome. Okay, so. So my stay here at the Kena pump track was actually pretty short. I just did a few roll arounds just to see what it was like. And it's actually more of a kid's track, but still has some fun stuff in it. There's still some fun little rollers, mini jumps and whatnot. But my next quest, obviously, was to see if I could figure out where this other new trail was. And I ended up getting lost. So I am completely lost as to where this hidden trail is. I'm looking for the crusher, cruiser, whatever you call it. Kettle, something. Something with a K or a C. A K like C, C like K sound. He said go down the dirt road. That's good directions, people. No trespassing until I get the new downhill mountain bike park built. Okay. Well, I don't know where this is. I'm gonna skip it. I really wanna do it, but I have no clue where it is. I looked in the map and I'm confused. All right, so I'm on the return now. I had no idea where that kettle Whatever that trail is in Cayuna. Over here, Cayuna. So obviously, I headed back to the connector, returning back to the Yankee unit. And this part of the trail ended up actually being really fun. Might be the last time coming up here this year. Considering it's August. Um, wow! I, I could have taken that with a regular speed. I wasn't sure if it turned really sharp. Next time I will fly the monkeys to the moon. Oh wow, I'm gonna skip that. All right, I'm gonna go for this jump. It looks scary. And I know I know I'm not gonna have enough speed. But, yeah, not even close. I had to get a lot more speed. So I don't know if my other video turned out or not. I'm heading back. I was not able to find kettle or whatever that trail is that's off in the middle of nowhere. I'm doing the snow breaks. Um, so I've decided to go back and do bobsled, et cetera, et cetera, and then do uh, a radar check. But this is actually a pretty fun trail, I think. I still going no brakes. <laughs> no brakes for the whole section. Oh, there's another jump. Oh, okay. So if you know your stuff and you keep your speed up. All right, I'm gonna have to brake right here. Just a little bit. I do not know. Man, this is, I did not know that this was gonna be so sweet on the way back. It's pretty fun. This is a fun trail. Now we come up and ride this trail. Again, for sure. I say it's getting boring again and then it turns awesome again. <laughs> This is, this is rocking. This is world class rocking. You rocket eater. I can, I can sense that something is coming though. Weatherwise, I got long haul number one or long haul number two. Or I go back and do regular trails. I just don't know what to expect. There's a rock roll. Doesn't look too bad. And if I did this again, I'd be hitting everything. I'm trying to beeline back to the car. I guess I'm gonna... 
What the heck? Hey, Alex Renee, do you like that one? It looks like a rock stack, but it's just the unusual shape of that rock. It's actually one rock. Very, very... I thought that was a stacked rock, and I'm like, holy crap. That's pretty awesome. It actually is pretty awesome. Hopefully it stays like that for many people to see. But this trail has got more downhill to it than I was expecting. Of course, I came uphill initially, so that kind of makes sense. I know I'm heading in the right direction, both with the hand and the trail. Wow, this is unending. I like it. And this is kind of what I needed for the moment to get my mind on. Well, where's, what's next? Okay, here we are going back into Cayuna State, whatever, State Recreation. So we're gonna be doing bobsled here pretty quick.